joining us here on 2K Sports for NBA basketball. This is Kevin Harlan joined by Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and on the sideline, David Aldridge. DA, it's all yours. Thanks very much. LeBron James has moved past Carl Malone for second place on the NBA's all-time scoring list. Does he envision claiming that number one spot of Kareem Abdul-Jabbar? Well, LeBron said, obviously, health plays the most important part. I never chased a record in my life. I just wanted to keep getting better. We'll see what happens. Kevin, back to you. Yeah, it's just a matter of time, David. Thank you. Let's take a look at our starters for Sacramento. Harrison Sabonis hold down the post positions for him. Malik Bunk out there with Fox, and it's Barnes in at the three spot. And for Los Angeles, the three stars on the floor together. Westbrook at the point, LeBron and Davis at the forward spots. Patrick Beverly out there with Thomas Bryant. And the Kings look a whole lot different now than they did for Mo Beyond the arc in the first. Yeah, the shocker of the 2022 trade deadline. A deal centered around DeMontis Sabonis going to Sacramento and Tyrese Halliburton sent to Indy. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Here's Schroeder. Outside Jones. Davis from long range. Barnes with the rebound. Minute 32 left in the first quarter. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Barnes has got five now. That blockbuster Sabonis Halliburton trade. What do you make of it for the Kings? Well, you know, B.A., Sacramento was a guard-heavy team. Sabonis adds size. He also adds playmaking, and I love his motor. I think it was a move to even out their roster. And the Lakers with possession here, following the score by Sacramento. Mitchell against Schroeder. Now here's Mitchell, tightly guarded. Barnes with a screen on Schroeder. Outside Barnes. That one's good. Mitchell making the play. Give him eight points now. When he gets a quality look like this at the perimeter, he can almost be automatic. Barnes has gotten three of his five to go tonight. James up top. He's guarded by Barnes. James passes to Jones. There's Davis with the three. And he finishes. That makes him four out of five. Oh, the response. AD might be a quiet guy off the court, but on the floor, he is an absolute killer. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Here's Fox. Kicks it out to Barnes. And he gets it to go. Four for six so far. I know it's early, but you have to wonder if these offenses can keep this up. There will be some letdown at some point, but these teams, they are built to score, so... Great teamwork and great timing. Oh, spectacular play. That one doesn't drop. And so it's Anthony Davis making things happen for Los Angeles. Hunting for opportunities, leading to nine points in the quarter. All right, stick around. We'll be right back after this. 26. for the greater good of the team. Putting winning first at all costs. When you think about it, through the years, Manu Ginobili with the Spurs, Andre Guadala in Golden State, it really can galvanize a team and lead to winning championships. Now here's Westbrook. This is the most they've led, 13 points. Count that one. He's now 5 for 8. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. And guys, to go on a big run, get some breathing space, it has to be a great play on each end. Here's Monk. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Sabonis outside. James against Barnes. They kick it out to Murray. They need this. Rebounded by the Lakers. Westbrook's got four rebounds in the game. It up top. Throw it down on the lob. 
management are leaving absolutely nothing on the table right now. Their focus and execution has been outstanding. It's caused them to pull away a bit. Let's see if they can keep the train on the tracks. Monk finds Fox, and the shot goes. He's got 10. Look at Fox fearlessly going inside, hunting for a higher percentage look. The Lakers shooting has been incredible, 72%. James, a screen on Fox. Pass to Davis, to the middle. Here's James, that's in there! Davis with the assist! James has got six points in the quarter. And he couldn't get an easier shot. The defense right now just looks defeated. Yeah, you'd love to see a little bit more fire on defense. Shoot any fire on defense. They can't just be giving the game away. Now here's Fox. Ten points for him. Late clock here. The Kings need to get one up. Up for three. The shot won't fall. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers looking in total control with this 17-point advantage as the buzzer sounds. And their defense has stood out, wreaking havoc for the opposition. We'll be right back. Cheer. Demonis Sabonis, he's checked in for Holmes. Murray comes in for Metu. Barnes, he's checked in for Herter. And De'Aaron Fox is subbed in for Davis. Now here's Sabonis. Ten points for him. Fox for three. And Reeves pulls it down. The Los Angeles Lakers, home to some of the greatest bigs of all time, Richard. Yeah, Will, Kareem, Shaq. Al Gasol, the Lake Show winning titles with those large dudes, proving that size does matter in this league. Here's Fox. He's got 12. And Sabonis slams it in. I like how Fox ran that two-man game, making the correct decision. I'd like to see that more from him. Los Angeles has gone one of four here in the third from range. James against Barnes. Here's Jones. Oh, 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 oh. nice finish. Man, oh, oh. big time right there. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. Well, the Kings shooting 42% on this third quarter. Fox outside. 29 seconds left in the third. Outside for Mitchell. Second chance shot. It's tipped. And they're able to recover. Murray from outside. Rebounded by the Lakers. James has got 11 rebounds in the game. Pass to Schroeder. Jones with a screen on Fox. One second left. And there's a nice layup by James. James has got 26 points. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Los Angeles Lakers. Dominating on the glass. What a quarter. Back after this. 64. A monster night for Fox. You can call him a point guard. I call him a scoring guard because that's what De'Aaron brings. It's stolen by Fox. Over Westbrook. And it's Fox missing. That's just a bucket uh, like you expect him to make. It's tough when you miss those. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Lakers. And you don't usually see this kind of blow. But tonight, they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never wavered in their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were, without a doubt, the better team. And as most people predicted, the defense, even though they were king on him, had no answers for Anthony Davis. He limited the opposing offense's impact as well with some superb defense, finding lots of chances to knock away shots. Westbrook outside. 40 seconds left in the game. Falls back and drains a fadeaway J. Their home crowd has energized them all game. Now they're closing it out. It's always nice to perform like this, especially in front of the faithful home crowd. Now here's Fox. Here's Herter. They get the rebound. 
Holmes, good. As usual, terrific effort from him. Unwilling to let the possession go to waste. They can simply hold on to the ball here. No question, B.A. They deserve the win. Fox against Westbrook. And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. We saw two different teams tonight. One played with confidence, operating flawlessly. The other just looked lost. And the energy in this building was awesome. The crowd was involved from the jump, and once they started to really pour it on, it was fun to see how it all came together. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. This is Brian Anderson. Thank you.